Hello and welcome to episode 45 of Treasure Hunting for Nostalgia, game show edition. This is Brad. This is Brandon. This is Nick. The title of our game show today, This or That, and the Shockmaster. Shockmaster. <laughs> <laughs> I am the Shockmaster. <laughs> So it's going to comprise on two different games. The first one, I've asked various family members which would they prefer. (laughs) For example, an apple or an orange. And then I recorded their answer. You have to guess what they preferred. I'm going to just take turns. So if you guys wanted to roll to see who goes first or Rochambeau, you're going to roll? Yeah. Gonna make me pull out my phone here. Okay. Brad picked up his phone like, I'll do this. No, roll dice. Uh-huh. 15, Fifteen. Ten. I will go first. You'll get one point for each correct answer. Zero points for each not correct answer. Mm-hmm. No penalty. And no chance to steal. No chance to steal. <laughs> first up, Jordan, my oldest son. Okay, Jordan's first question. Mega Man or Mega Man X? Hmm. I'm going to say Mega Man. Correct. Nick. Simon Belmont or Alucard? Belmont. Correct. Strawberry ice cream or vanilla ice cream, Brandon? Strawberry. Vanilla. Ah. Oh. I know, I was like, vanilla, really? Okay, Nick. Shakira or Gwen Stefani? Mm. Gwen Stefani. Incorrect. Did he say, who's Gwen Stefani? He did. <laughs> he did not know who she was. You know, Shakira, but not Gwen Stefani? From The Voice, yeah. Uh, I love that show. <laughs> okay, Brandon. Harry Potter or Gandalf? Harry Potter. Yeah, he said Harry Potter. And both of his brothers looked at him and did, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Nick. Math or science? Science. Incorrect. Math. Brandon? Taco Tuesday or Freaky Friday? <laughs> Taco Tuesday. Taco Tuesday. <laughs> Okay, now we're going to go to my middle child, Samuel. Nick's turn. Randy Orton or Batista? Ooh. Uh, Randy Orton. Correct. And after that, he said, I had to pick one. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. Brandon, Final Fantasy or Zelda? Zelda. Nope. Wow. He said Final Fantasy because my rationale is... I'm playing Final Fantasy X right now, Uh-oh. and so he's probably thinking Final Fantasy. Hmm. Okay, Nick, you're up. Stone Cold Steve Austin or The Undertaker? Hmm. <sighs> Undertaker. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Wow, I would have put my money on, on Undertaker, too. I only said it because Stone Cold's not in the limelight right now. Yeah. He likes playing with him on 2K14, oh, okay. and he flips off the thing as his taunt, <laughs> and it blurs out his fingers, yeah, yeah, so he yeah, thinks yeah. he's doing something naughty. <laughs> okay, Brandon. Beef or chicken? Beef. Beef. Nick? Fire or ice? <laughs> Fire. Correct. Brandon? Michael Jackson or Tito Jackson? (laughs) I was going to go with Tito Jackson. He said, who's Tito Jackson? (laughs) He said Michael Jackson. Oh, okay. Okay, Nick. Luke Skywalker or Frodo Baggins? I have to go with Frodo Baggins for the same logic. He said Luke Skywalker. Oh, man. This kid's all over the place. (laughs) Now we'll go with Logan. Wind. Brandon, corn dog or kick to the nuts? <laughs> kick to the nuts. Corn dog. Nick, Muno or Plex? 
much? Yo Gabba Gabba characters. <laughs> the big red thing that looks like a dildo or Plex the robot? Plex. He said Plex. What's the female character's name? Uh, the, Fufa? The, the pink one? Uh, uh, that's, uh, there's Fufa, which is a blue one, I think. No. no that's a pink one. Fufa is it a is pink Fufa, one. Right? Yeah. I said Fufo or something like that. The blue one is 2D, I think. He was wearing a Yo Gabba Gabba shirt. One, one of them was Broby, I think his name Broby, is. Broby, the green one. And then the other one was the pink one, Fufo. Dude, I love that show. <laughs> it was pretty cool. DJ the, Lance the Rock. The South Park episode was hecka good, though. That Yo Gabba Gabba South Park? Yeah, the one where he's, um, who was, someone was trying to tame that. St- oh, it was uh, Kyle's brother. Ike, mm-hmm. he, he he like matured like a quick, and he he kept saying, "I'm going to tame that string." You, know, you haven't seen that? <laughs> I one? remember that, yeah. And he was talking about the Yo Gabba Gabba character Fufa. Hmm. It's like a funny. Brandon Cern, yes. Pokemon or Dragon Ball Z? Dragon Ball Z. Pokemon. Nick, pizza or sushi? Pizza. Sushi. Oh man. Complex, <laughs> sophisticated. Brandon, the Beatles or Elvis? Elvis. Elvis. Nick, Adventure Time or the regular show? <laughs> Adventure Time. Correct. Brandon, Miami Dolphins or Dallas Cowboys? Dolphins. Dolphins. He said because I used to play for the Dolphins. Remember the, <laughs> the jersey we had? He thought I was on the Dolphins. <laughs> you asked Logan a lot of questions, huh? Um, that was the last one. Yeah. Now we're going to my mother. Oh, jeez. Our mother. I'm gonna get all these ones. <laughs> is it whose turn? Is it Nick's turn, right? Because yeah. you had Dallas Cowboys. All right, pie or cake? <laughs> pie. She said cake, even though she just got done telling me that she hates eating cake. <laughs> <laughs> and I brought it up. And she said, "Well, I don't like to eat cake in the morning." <laughs> <laughs> I just sit there and listen to an hour-long story <laughs> of how people were serving cake at work, and it was not appropriate because it was in the morning. <laughs> All right, Brandon. Foot massage or back massage? Foot. Correct. Nick. Corn dog or kick to the nuts? <laughs> <laughs> kick to the nuts. Correct. She said she, she hates corn dogs <laughs> and she hates giving them. She hates what? She hates corn dogs and she hates giving them. Oh wow. Okay, Brandon. Mario or Luigi? Mario. Yes. Nick. Batman or Superman? Batman. Correct. It's whichever movie she just watched. <laughs> That's what I was thinking too. <laughs> um, Brandon. Blondes or brunettes? Brunette. Correct. Ravishing Rick Rude. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> And she said it with a question, like she she felt ashamed of picking one, and I could see she just went through the list of all her past lovers in her head, and I was doing the same because they all have black hair. <laughs> okay, um, Nick, wheat toast or sourdough? Uh, sourdough. Wheat toast. Brandon, Will Ferrell or Jim Carrey? Jim Carrey. She said Will Ferrell. And she offered an explanation. You kind of have to get used to him. <laughs> it made so much sense. All right, Nick. Ron Jeremy or Peter North? Ron Jeremy. Correct. She said, I, who are those porn guys? I don't know who they are. I've never seen him. Well, I've seen Ron Jeremy on The Sorrel Life and in Disneyland, so I'm going to pick him. Yeah. 
Didn't you have a funny story about Disneyland? About her not recognizing his face, but yes. recognizing other parts of his anatomy? She, she said, oh, that was Ron Jeremy? Because me and Brandon pointed out, look, look, it's Ron Jeremy. And he was on there walking through Disneyland on a mission, all sweating, looking for some prey. <laughs> like 90 degrees, it was heck of hot outside. And, and she was like, oh, that was Ron Jeremy? I didn't recognize his face. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now we're going to my wife, Karen. Really branched out on the uh, uh, friends and family members on this one, huh? Yeah, I've got myself and also Matt to go. So I did have to make a call to Matt and Mom, so I did branch out. <laughs> Colgate or Crest? <laughs> Is that me? Yes. Oh, uh, Crest. Correct. Okay, Nick. Personally, I choose Colgate. You <laughs> Rap or hip hop? Rap or hip hop? Yes. To Karen? Yes. Hip hop. Correct. I didn't marry no ghetto girl. <laughs> Dragon Ball Z or My Little Pony? My Little Pony. Correct. Okay, Nick. Sega or Sony? Sony. Correct. Brandon, ball gag or being tied up? <laughs> being tied up. Correct. I've never been able to get a ball gag on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now these are the questions I asked myself. That's when she stopped you. She's like, no more questions. <laughs> How do you know? <laughs> Who's it on now? Nick? Nick. Mm -hmm. Battle of the Four Fiends or Eris theme? Four Fiends. Correct. Brandon. Nickelback or Deftones? Oh, uh, oh man. Deftones. Trick question. Neither. <laughs> Nick. Rocky Horror Picture Show or Little Shop of Horrors? Picture show. Correct. Brandon, Lulu or Tiffa? Lulu. Correct. Nick, sword or axe? Sword. Correct. Brandon, Kubrick or Tarantino? <laughs> Neither. Incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> It was Kubrick because of Clockwork Orange. Yes. Last person, Matt. Wild card. Chaos. Was a wild card in the whole uh, <laughs> Heaven and Hell game show. It's on Nick now? Yep. Pokemon or Dragon Ball Z? Pokemon. Incorrect. He took like a minute to answer that. Yeah, any real man would. <laughs> <laughs> To try to figure out which one's gay or anything. <laughs> okay. Brandon, girl on top or doggy? <laughs> I'm going to say he's submissive, so doggy. <laughs> How is that being submissive? Because he uh, does what she wants. Does she wants want. doggy? Yeah. You know this for a fact? Yep. Okay. Oh, I was on the podcast, wasn't it? Yep. All right, Nick. Was, was it right or wrong? wrong? It was right. Doggy, yeah. Uh, light spank or take that bitch? <laughs> <laughs> so he's submissive, so that would indicate light spank, right? I'm going to go light spank. No. Oh, oh man. I feel sorry for Lisa. Um, <laughs> or does he like the, light, the take oh, that bitch? Man. He might like um, Jim on American Pie. Yeah. Um, taco or corn dog? Oh man! See, he likes tacos with no lettuce, but he he does love corn dogs. I'm gonna say, corn dog taco. Uh -huh. Nick, worms or maggots? <laughs> uh, worms. Correct. Brandon, Jason or Michael Myers? Jason. Correct. Very I didn't, close. I didn't care if that was wrong or right. I I was picking one. <laughs> Just like the Kubrick and yeah. Tarantino. 
it's jacked up. Okay, so that does it for uh, our first part of the game. Uh, this and that. What's the score is that? Uh, it's 15 to 14. Wow. With Brandon leading. I think Brandon got an extra question, too. That might have worked out that way <laughs> since he got to go first. So, the next part of the game will be a trivia game. With these five categories, we have Rockman. You've acquired an item in a song. Power, Wisdom, and Courage. Hmm. Sexy Time, which is sexual education. <laughs> Title Change. I like how he explained all only one of those categories. <laughs> so, I'm going back to that. Rockman is questions on Mega Man. Uh, Power, Wisdom, and Courage is questions on Zelda. You've acquired an item in a song. This one's a little tricky. I'm going to name a few nouns in some songs, and you have to try to guess the song. Like if I say um, Neon Lights and uh, Gandhi, the answer would be... Cult of Personality. There you go. Title change are WWF title changes. <laughs> and that is it. There will be no final question. I will not reveal the scores until the end, so you guys ask every question. And... If you get an answer wrong, you will get shocked. We, <laughs> we have a muscle stimulator attached to Brandon and Nick that I have complete control over. The shock master. <laughs> so depending on what question they get wrong, it will be multiplied by two. So if oh, it's fuck. if they get a one point question <laughs> wrong, they'll they'll get a number two, which is pretty light. If they get a five point question wrong, it'll go up max level ten. <laughs> So, do are we buzzing in or like is it's it all back and forth? Going back and forth. So okay, so I'm, I guess I'm first because Brandon got the last Correct. question. Correct. And do I get to choose? You get to choose any category, any number. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Can I lose points? You cannot lose points. I just you, get shot. You just get shot. All right. <clears throat> um. <laughs> I guess I'll do sexy time for two. Sexy time. And do we get a steal? No. no. Oh, okay. Because there's some true or false questions on here. True or false? All vaginas taste the same. <laughs> false. I don't know the answer to that. I think it's false too. <laughs> <laughs> so you get the point. I mean, doesn't it kind of... It makes sense that they wouldn't, but... Nice research. <laughs> you really can't research that. <laughs> it's common sense. Your turn. Oh, uh, I'll go power, wisdom, courage for two. I saw you lift your hands up. I thought I was about to get shocked. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, <laughs> How many rupees can you hold in the original Legend of Zelda game? Oh, jeez. Uh... Do it one or the other. Um, I say I should be able to still the, multiply the shot. <laughs> <laughs> Not for points, just to make the pain worse. But then if I get it wrong, I get shot. Yeah. 300. No. Incorrect. Do you know it? I think it's 255. That is exactly right. Let's do this. So we're going um, four. Four. It might not feel that much painful. Not too bad, huh? Oh, no, that's nothing. <laughs> you idiot! Don't tell him that. You're like, oh! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> turn it <See>? up. <laughs> Why did you turn it up? Because you said it was nothing. <laughs> but that's not the rules. <laughs> I'm the game master this time. <laughs> okay. So, Nick. Nick's turn. Oh, man. Um, sexy time for three. I'm guessing you're doing these because you took that human sexuality class. <laughs> yeah, like ten years ago. <laughs> True or false? There is 20 grams of protein in one cup of semen. <laughs> 20 grams in one cup? 
It's a lot of semen. <laughs> True. It's false. Okay. <laughs> it's approximately five grams. In one cup? Yeah. Wow, that's a lot. It also determines of how much sperm is in there because that's where the protein comes from. So you couldn't do that if you're vegetarian. You wouldn't get enough supplement. Right. So we're going to put Nick on six. <laughs> okay, I got it. I got it. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'll do power, wisdom, courage for three. How do you kill dark knots in Legend of Zelda? Hit him in the back. Incorrect. Hit him in the side or in the back. Ooh, technicality. <laughs> well, is that a three-pointer? Yeah. The six is not fun. <laughs> I did not enjoy that. <laughs> did that feel good? <laughs> yeah, it felt awesome. <laughs> Brandon's stronger than I am. That hurt. Next turn. Oh, sorry. Um, I'll take that one point Zelda question. Would uh hit it? Would if I would have said don't hit him in the front, would that have sufficed? Can't you kill him yeah. with bombs too? He but, can, but only if it hits the back. But well, it would. Hit the back. <laughs> this is the name of the final boss in Zelda Two: The Adventures of Link. official name Link Shadow correct <laughs> okay Shadow of Link <laughs> uh, I'll do uh, Rockman for one this is the best weapon in Mega Man history the metal blade correct that's very subjective no it's not it's fact <laughs> I'm scared of doing those high value <laughs> ones. That shit's gonna hurt. Let's do it. Let's do um the what is it, what is it called the Zelda one for four? Some, something courage and power wisdom courage. Power wisdom courage. That's right. What is thought to be the first game in Zelda chronologically history? We just talked about how much bullshit the <laughs> we did. summary of Zelda games are. Um, I mean, it would make sense that the first one was, but I, but he's not. I don't know if he's a kid. I'll go with um, Link to the Past. Do you know it? Skyward Sword. It's yeah. correct. That's when they form the Master Sword. So that was a four pointer. It shouldn't be too bad. Oh yeah. Wait, no, that's Brandon. <laughs> so gotta, gotta go eight. Sorry. <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. Five power and courage. We have to do them. I Name two things that are different between the gold and gray version of Ocarina of Time. Game-wise? Yes, there's two things that are different. I don't know, there is a difference. Ganon's blood in the censored version is purple instead of red, like in the gold version, and they also have religious chanting. That they took out. So in the gold version, his blood is red? Yes. What is that, 10? Yes. <laughs> Brandon just kicked me. Oh, did I? <laughs> That's probably Don't a, take it out on him. A reflex. <laughs> you think? Uh, sexy time for four. Fuck it. The official name for oral sex 
for male and female. Fellatio? It's one. Oh, there's more? For female, too. Oh. It's different. <laughs> I don't know. I, I know it's not right, but cunnilingus. That's right. Is it? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I thought cunnilingus was like straight sex. No? No. I mean, I knew that. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Nick. <clears throat> Same category for five. Name three ways you can ensure a massive cum shot. <laughs> Uh, eat zinc. <laughs> Two more. Uh, don't come for a week. <laughs> That's actually written on here. One more. <laughs> Edging. The zinc makes a thicker load, not more volume. So that's incorrect. Uh -huh. Stay hydrated. <laughs> The more you know. <laughs> Which one hurts more, that one or this one? <laughs> that one does. This one does? Yeah. Okay. So the, oh. <laughs> I thought I was getting shocked there. Um, so there's like a prickly one and a numbing one, or what? what is it? It's, more, it's like a thump instead of like a needle. Hmm. I think I've only been hit with the needle one so far. Is that right? Yeah, because the thumping one is like more intense, like boom, boom. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, Hold on, I... your electrode's coming off. Oh, that's too bad. <laughs> I'm going to okay. go with that song one, uh, You Earned an Item. Yeah. Uh, let's go with three to start it off. A seal. Morse code. A seal and Morse code? I have no idea. What does the fox say? Oh, oh I heard that song one time. Yeah. <laughs> you can see it too. <laughs> I said two. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh, you're reaching for that five. Mega Man learned how to charge his buster in this game. Mega Man 3. It's Mega Man 4. Is it? Yeah. It's 4. Oh, man. <laughs> this one shouldn't hurt as bad. Yeah, it's only four. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. I'm going to finish off sexy time for one. Playing it safe. Yeah. One of usually two organs that produce ova and secrete estrogen. One of, what did you say? One of two? One of two organs. Ovaries? Correct. Rockman 3. Mega Man learned how to slide in this game. Mega Man 3. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Habit. I was about to shock Brandon. <laughs> I'm going to try that song one for two. A jump to the left, a step to the right, and pelvic thrusts. I have no idea. Some gay dance song. Melissa knew what it was. <laughs> if you were friends with Jamie Paulson, you'd know too. Dang. Do you know, Brandon? Time Warp. It's the Time Warp. Uh, I know it now that I <laughs> know what it is. <laughs> Sexy Time is all done, right? Sexy Time is done. Okay. Uh, let's do uh, the song one for one. Playing it safe. Yeah. Dreams of war, dreams of liars, dreams of dragons fire, and of things that will bite. 
Enter Sandman. Correct. Oh, it was so easy. I didn't get it until the dragons fire apart. I'm not going to do it the song one, but I'll do it for four. <clears throat> Stormy Nights of Fire, Dragon's Tongue, Moonlight. <laughs> Any Dragon Four song. <laughs> <laughs> it's Inferno. Is that a Dragon Sym- Four song? Symphony, oh, Symphony X. X. Okay. I gotta go up to eight. <laughs> uh, title change for one. Oh, dang. This wrestler broke the honky tonk man streak for the Intercontinental Championship. Oh, Ultimate Warrior. <laughs> Correct. I'll try that for two. This wrestler beat Eddie Guerrero to win the World Heavyweight Championship. Bonus points if you guess what type of match it was. I seem to remember watching this not very really long ago, but I don't remember who it was. Uh, Brett the Hitman Hart. JBL. <laughs> no! I, I didn't watch that. <laughs> and it was a Texas bull rope match. Oh, <laughs> Let's do it, Rockman for four. My God. Who needs to get scalped and sent back to the reservation? Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Tomahawk man. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, Fuck it. Let's do that song one for five. A rocking chair, an attic, and a teapot that Missy found. (laughs) I have no idea. Just give me the shot. It's welcome home. What the fuck is Welcome Home? King, King Diamond. Diamond. <laughs> Ten. Oh, man. <laughs> the guy's back. You can see it? Yeah. <laughs> Rockman 5. Who beats Particle Man? That's not even Mega Man. Triangle Man? Correct. Whew. What? That's a We Might Be Giant song. The Particle Man, Particle Man. <laughs> uh, title change for three. You can't do that. <laughs> That's not a Mega Man question. <laughs> Name two wrestlers to hold the WWE Championship for less than one day. Daniel Bryan. That's one. <clears throat> I know CM Punk got fucked a lot, so I'll just say CM Punk. Correct. Other acceptable answers? Andre the Giant, Rey Mysterio, John Cena, Randy Orton, and Triple H. Hmm. Title change for five. This tag team held the tag team championship for less than one day. Who was it? Edge and Christian. John Cena and The Miz. That's retarded. That's not a real tag team. (laughs) You see it shaking? Uh, what's left? That's it. Total what? change for four. That's the only one left? Yes. Oh, okay. I guess I'll take it. Once Ultimate Warrior won the World Heavyweight Championship from Hulk Hogan, the Intercontinental Belt was vacated. There was a tournament to see who would get it. Who won it? Huh. 
I'm gonna go with Brett the Hitman hard. <laughs> it was Mr. Perfect. That was my guess. Just pure guess. That makes sense. <laughs> so let's tally up these points here. It was very close. With one point, Nick wins. Oh. One by one? Yes. Oh, wow. That um, th three-pointer you just won yeah. put you over. The Daniel Bryan one? Yep. So let's take off your two electrodes. Oh, Sorry. That's going to be the worst part. <laughs> Nick's a little hairy. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll put him on Brandon's. Oh, what are you talking about? <laughs> You said, what are you talking about? <laughs> this wasn't explained. <laughs> it's a surprise. <laughs> I'll, I'll allow it. <laughs> Two thirds majority vote. <laughs> so we'll just go make our way up here on both electrodes. <laughs> <laughs> Did that hurt a little bit? <laughs> Is that all you've got? Oh! <laughs> you feel like a masochist now. Here comes the other one. How about the? How about this one? <laughs> Let's see. Oh. It's because I learned how to turn up the voltage <laughs> just right now. Oh, that, that feels like I don't even know how to explain it. <laughs> Can you do it again so we get it video? Get it on video? Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm just kidding. I wouldn't ask oh. you to do that. <laughs> oh. Dude, stop. <laughs> do you say mercy? <laughs> I can't even. I can't talk. <laughs> you guys ready for some prizes? <laughs> yeah. I mean, that wasn't my prize. <laughs> that one sucked. What did you say about the voltage? You could turn up the voltage right here. Oh. To 260 or whatever. PW. Something that yeah, just makes it more that much. It violent. makes it more violent. Oh man! <laughs> it's like uh, a monster was on my shoulders, just crushing me like this. That's what it felt like. So Brandon, here's your prize. Maybe I'll send some relief to you tonight. <laughs> it's your back scratcher. It's metal too. Oh, it's tight. It's oh man! And it extends. <laughs> That's like a cool. So, Nick, this is your prize. Oh, man. Packaging. Ripped packaging. Oh, uh, nice. Could use this tomorrow. Oh, that's like a tight. That's, I found that on your wish list. Yeah, I was looking awesome. through all the Nicholas A. Joneses, <laughs> and I was like <laughs> searching for like 15 minutes. I wonder which one his is. And then I the one saw, that's under my email address? I didn't, <laughs> any, I didn't know how to search by that. So I saw one with Penn and Teller. I was like, this might be it. <laughs> And with Mario and with many bosses, like this is it. And that's all the disc. So what Brad got me was a disc golf disc. Uh, it's a glow in the dark one. So you go on those late night treks. That's really cool. Thanks, Brad. Yep. Is that a putter? Uh, no, it looks. Oh, it's a 170. <laughs> it's a 170. <laughs> it doesn't say specifically on it. It's a T-Bird, which uh, that's kind of like a. It's a driver. It's like a fairway driver. Thank you very much. That's awesome. Yep. I expected them to be a little bit heavier. It, it all depends on what you buy. So do you throw it like a Frisbee or like a discus? Uh, You don't throw it like a discus. You don't like spin around in circles. You throw it pretty much like a Frisbee, just more violent, I guess. Okay. Does <laughs> it have better control than a Frisbee? Because my Frisbee throws go all over the place. 
It all depends on how good you are, really. Okay. I mean, with a frisbee, generally you throw it with your index finger yeah. on the edge of it like that. Mm -hmm. With this particular disc, you generally throw it like this. Oh, okay. With all four fingers underneath. Oh, cool. That better control. Yeah. Okay. So that's going to do it for this edition of Treasure Hunting for Nostalgia. This or that. Shockmaster. <laughs> this is Brad. This is Brandon. This is Nick. Happy hunting. <laughs>